Hey guys, welcome back to VL Infotech. Today in this video, we will see how to write a Python program to find number of factors and number of even factors and number of odd factors of a given number using for loop. In previous videos, we have seen by using while loop, we calculated, we printed number of factors, number of even, number of odd factors of a given number. In this video, we will see by using for loop. By using for loop and while loop, we will get the same output. But coding is different. We will see that difference. So let's get started. While writing code, we need to be careful while giving indentation spaces. Otherwise, we will get indented errors. These are basic programs in Python. In further videos, we will see more complex programs. So please subscribe to my channel and support me for more interesting videos. Yeah, we are done. Now we need to save the file. Click on file. Click on save as. Now you can give any file name. Like here I will give pack evo dot py. We need to save the python file with the extension dot py. So file name with the extension dot py and click on save. Yeah, file is saved and we also got python folder here. Now we need to execute this python program in command prompt. To open command prompt, click cmd, enter cmd. Yeah, command prompt is open. Now we need to give path cd space desktop enter dictionary dir. Now we need to give file name pack evo.py enter. Now you can give any number. Now I want to find number of factors and number of even, number of odd factors of 10. So I am entering 10. Yeah, these are the factors of 10 and these are the total number of factors and these are even factors 2 and 2 comma 10. And these are factors, odd factors, 1 comma 5. In this way, we can find number of factors, like uh, what are the factors, total factors, and what are the even factors in that, what are the odd factors in that, we can find. Now, we will see once again, file name, 
dot py now i want to calculate i want to find factors of uh, 32 enter see we are getting factors of 32 as 1 2 4 8 60 32 total number of factors are 6 and even factors are 2 4 8 16 32 and odd factors are 1 in this way we need to find number of factors total factors and in that even factors and we can separate odd factors i will copy this and i will paste here this is the output and this is the code now we will see now we will see the code line by line this line of code is used to enter a number by the user and this is for counting the number of factors so we are initializing a variable c equal to 0 c equal to 0 0 is the initial value now this is the even factor variable this is the odd factor and we are differentiating with comma now for syntax for x in range of n comma n plus 1 here x in range of 1 comma n plus 1 means for example if we give n value as 10 now x value ranges from 1 comma 11 so the loop will repeat for 10 times after finishing the loop repeating for 10 times it will exit the loop so it will enter the loop and it will check the condition n modulus x equal equal 0 if this statement is true then it will print x if this condition is true then it will print x here x is the factor of the given number now we need to check the number is even factor or odd factor for that we use this code if x modulus 2 equal equal 0 means we are checking even factor or not if this modulus operator will give remainder as 0 equal equal 0 then it will print even factor or else it will print odd factor and later it will count number of factors after finishing the loop for 10 times then later on it will print number of factors equal to and even factors equal to odd factors equal to we will see the output See, enter a number. So we are entering 32. I will show you line by line. See, we are entering a number by using this line of code. And later on, we are checking using this for loop. It will print x. So it is printing first x value. This is the first factor. 1 is the first factor. And later on, it will checking even factor or not. If this statement is true, it will add even factor to this string or else it will add odd factor to this string and it will count. It will do this for 10 times. After doing this, it will exit the loop and it will print the values. See number of factors equal to 6 over here and even factors. This is the new line. So it is printing in the new line even factors equal to we are storing even factors in ef and we are storing odd factors in of so we are printing ef of here number of factors equal to 2 4 8 16 32 we are printing number of odd factors 1 in this way we need to find number of factors and factors of that number and what are even and what are odd factors of that number I hope everyone clear with this code. If you have any questions, any doubts regarding this code and output, please comment down below. That's it for today's video. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon so that you will never miss an update. I will see you in the next video. Until then, keep coding.